It happened in just a few weeks. Our own greed did us in. And before we knew it, the dollar flu spread like wildfire. A few weeks. That's how long it took for a civilization to collapse. The governor of New York has asked for federal help as city services are collapsing. Manhattan was being torn apart. So they locked it down. Or tried. But it was already too late. The government is resorting to drastic measures to tackle the crisis. We will not stand idly by while our great country crumbles. Decisive measures must be employed. That is why the president today has decided to invoke Directive 51. So they finally activated us. The Strategic Homeland Division. An elite group of embedded agents. We walk among you. We are you, until we are activated. Then we leave everything behind to answer the call. When all else fails, we are the last resort, the last line of defense, and we will give our lives to save what remains. Welcome, Agent Candidate, to your virtual pre-testing session. This simulation will assess your SHD recruit potential. As your division recruiter, I will be evaluating your performance today. And we'll start with body awareness and basic movement. Show me what you got. Excellent. Now, let's put that into some context. Complete the obstacle course. Well done. Let's move on to the next module. Agents must maintain expert level proficiency with a wide variety of small arms. Good. Let's increase the range a bit. Well done. Now let's see deal with moving targets. Good shot. Let's see how you perform with a sniper rifle. Excellent. I've marked you as go for marksmanship. The effect of a well-placed grenade on multiple targets shouldn't be underestimated. and marksmanship module. Good job so far, candidate. In this next module, we'll assess cover tactics and basic combat skills. Whenever possible, a smart agent will move from cover to cover to outmaneuver and flank the enemy. Let's increase the stress level a bit. Your objective is to reach the end of the corridor and destroy the hostile turret. 
don't get killed. You must learn to anticipate the time windows when the turret stops firing. These will be your opportunity to counterattack or advance to another cover. Tactics module. Well done. If a hostile gets too close, you need to whack him hard. Ah! Okay, candidate. This last module will assess your intuitive use of some of the classified technology. You have two primary shade tech devices at your disposal. Employ these to eliminate the enemy. in your arsenal is your signature device. Deploy it to turn the table on your enemy. <sighs> Demonstrate to me how you handle yourself in a combat situation with all the weapons and devices at your disposal. Signature ability ready. instincts agent candidate you have two primary shape tech devices at your disposal employ these to eliminate the enemy
Lethal tech in your arsenal is your signature device. Deploy it to turn the table on your enemy. Wait, what? what? Demonstrate to me how you handle yourself in a combat situation with all the weapons and devices at your disposal. Signature ability ready. primary shade tech devices at your disposal. Employ these to eliminate the enemy. The oh, fuck! Ah! Almost too easy! Oh my god! The most powerful tech in your arsenal is your signature device. Deploy it to turn the table on your enemy. Who are you guys? What was that? Good. Demonstrate to me how you handle yourself in a combat situation. With all the weapons and devices at your disposal. Signature ability ready. The oh, fuck? primary shade tech devices at your disposal. Employ these to eliminate the enemy. your arsenal is your signature device. Deploy it to turn the table on your enemy. Holy shit! Demonstrate to me how you handle yourself in a combat situation. With all the weapons and devices at your disposal. Signature ability ready.
performance candidate, that concludes the final pre-testing session. I'm happy to confirm that you have been accepted as an agent recruit. Now the training begins in earnest, and then let's hope we're never activated.
cover. Hey, we'll deal with this. Heads up! Crazy. I just saw a JTF soldier shot dead. Yeah, the JTF has been overwhelmed. They're needed. What is Watch this? yourself. You Let's finish them off. Hey, I'm gonna make you bleed. We sit on our asses, the more dangerous it gets. We will move, Kevin, as soon as Agent Kelly's partner shows up. But I can help with the escort. You are not a trained professional. This is real. It's not some movie. Speak of the devil. Welcome to the Spring Blossom Restaurant. I'm Angela Chan, and this is my nephew, Kevin. I'm Kelly. Good to see you. You've been briefed, right? Chief Meyer updated me. We're getting Mrs. Chan out of here? Mrs. Chan refuses to leave without her people. We're taking all of them to the checkpoint. Hold here while we clear the way. Very well. I should go with them. No, Kevin. Let the agents do their jobs. I need you with us. What? Enough. The JTF is sending trucks to the Manhattan Bridge checkpoint. That's where we're taking Mrs. Chan and her little flock. English woman. But first, we must clear the way of any gun-happy numbnuts looking to crash the party. operating with impunity in some areas. Be careful.
Thank God you came. They got the drop on us. This is all foobar. We've been begging for reinforcements for two hours. Sneak, you fuckers got me. Take them out. Moving to cover. Damn punks. Yeah, this is Kelly. The way is clear. Get going. I could kill for a foamy latte right now. What the hell? Here comes our flock. Thank you. We're not out of the woods just yet. Get your people inside and find cover. There's more of them coming! Find some cover! Guys are out in force today. Well done, Agent. Chopper stat. Uh, I'll see what I can do, ma'am. We owe you our lives. What you did. Just doing our job, ma'am. 
Now can I go? Kevin, I'm sure Gabrielle is safe. Go where? My girlfriend is a nurse in the Trinity Church Field Hospital. I want to make sure she's okay. Trinity Church? I know a doctor there, O'Neill. He'd let me know if there was any trouble, and I haven't heard from him. But... Your job now is to protect your people here, Kevin. If there's any danger to the hospital, me and my colleague will deal with it. That's our job, and we're pretty damn good at it. Looks like our ride is here.
don't have the manpower to patrol the quarantined area. People are gonna die in there unless you get your act together, Captain. Look, Agent, I'm not a wizard. Yeah? What's up, Doc? Shit. What about the JTF? I hear you. Just hold on, okay? We're coming. I need the chopper again. What? Again? But... Roger Wilco. Agent. That was Doc O'Neill. The field hospital at Trinity Church has come under attack. That boy Kevin was right to be worried. They need help. I can count on you, right? Of course. Then let's go. and make our way down. Here's an elevator. Looks beat up. Hope it works. we deserve, right? Gets you wondering if maybe it's the system that's not Trinity Church isn't far. Let's move. Take them 
have time for this. Come on! Looks like they got hit hard. Let's look for survivors. Hang in there, trooper. They... They go into the stock exchange. Took the support weapons. Specify. 50 cals and Gustavs. Oh, God! What the hell were you thinking bringing heavy weapons here? I didn't... Orders. Oh, no, you don't. Stay with us. <laughs> Too many stupid mistakes. I guess we should be grateful that JTF didn't bring mortars, too. Kelly to Meyer, be advised the bad guys now have heavy weapons, stingers, goose stops, and 50 cows. Acknowledged. I've asked the JTF commander about these weapons, but the order to bring them in didn't come from him. Well, someone screwed up royally, and it'll cost us lives. Kelly out. Let's move on to Trinity Church. We'll never get past that. Fastest way to the church is now through the stock exchange. We can smoke up the scum suckers in there while we're at it. You're a dead man! Look, I said strawberry, not chocolate, and it's not even cold! 
but I couldn't find any strawberries. Jax, look! No, 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 not now. I'm gonna go get myself a decent milkshake. You waste them, Carl. Bring me back their heads. Another well-adjusted citizen. Let's take them out. Situation is Fubar. We got a potential hostage situation at Trinity Church. Copy. I'll try to free up more people. Do it. But we can't wait for them. Head in there now. Understood. Good luck. What the hell is Carl doing? He should be done by now. It's the division! violent incidents in lower Manhattan. The JTF is trying to reinforce their positions there. The JTF doesn't know what they're doing. Nobody does. 
This whole catastrophe really is a complete failure of imagination. I hope Doc O'Neill is okay. Let's check inside. God damn scum. Where were you? Your division, aren't you? Where the hell were you? You were supposed to protect us, damn it. I'm sorry, Doctor. We. Ugh, oh, whatever. I'm sure you tried. Doc O'Neill, is, is he. gone with the others? He told them to take him instead of me. I. Is your name Gabrielle, by any chance? Yes. Yes, it is. Why? Someone wants to talk to you. Hello? Kevin! You know where they went? No clue. Just caught a name. Jax. Seemed to be the top rabid dog. All right. Let's go look outside. See what we can see. Sorry. About this. Yeah. Me too. Plenty of CCTV cameras echo available. We should be able back. to get an echo of what happened. chopper again. Let's head back to Camp Hudson. I'm gonna go secure us some boats. Make sure you have enough ammo and come find me when you're ready.
I got us some naval support. Ready to go? I'm ready. Then let's cast off. I don't want to lose any more time. Look! O'Neill is a friend, sure, but there's a bigger picture, too. The dollar flu won't go away anytime soon, and we'll need skilled doctors if we're ever gonna get out of this mess. People like Doc O'Neill and that woman Kendall back at Trinity. Here we go, buckle up! Find the hostages. We gotta hurry. God knows what that psycho Jax is planning for O'Neill and the others. Keep moving. Where are the hostages? I ain't telling you shit. My knee! God, it hurts! I'll ask again. Where are the hostages? Jack got him up by the statue. Uh, he's crazy. He's loading the supplies onto a ferry and rigging the whole place to ball. I... Mercy kill. We're out of time. What the hell? We're SHD. This is not how we do things. That man was unarmed. You think he'd hesitate to pick up another gun and shoot us in the back? Safer this way. Let's move. We're losing time. Jacks hurt the dock or the other hostages.
I see you. must be inside. Get us out of here! Damn. You'll need to defuse that thing. I'm not great Please with wires. Help us! Look how it's connected to the door. We can't get those people out unless you disarm it. Don't I'll cover from here. here. Careful. I don't want to die. Please help us. Don't leave us in here. I don't want to die! EOD was never my thing. Let's get him out. Don't leave us in here! Sarah? Oh, thank God you came. Would never leave you hanging, Doc. Agent, meet Doc O'Neill, a genius researcher I'm proud to call my friend. I'm grateful to you both. Did you catch that freak, Jax? He's over by the ferry, I think. He's next. We'll catch up later, Doc. Let's move! Reprobate got lucky. My aim's busted. We gotta stop Jax. I'll go after him, and you escort the civvies to safety. Crafty bastard, so watch your six. Cigars are on me when you get back. Kelly here. The hostages are safe, and the dock too. Now, waste that clown and we'll call it a day.
You then. Oh, <laughs> but I did. You and your kind. <laughs> your days are over. Society is just a sham. All it took was a hyped up flu to tear it all down. <laughs> You're wrong. We'll get through this. We'll rebuild. Yeah, you tell yourself that. Lucky for you. Santa came early this year. <coughs> Merry fucking Christmas. Morning, Agent. And it actually is morning, too. Good timing. Your vitals look good enough. How about you try and sit up for me? How long? Well, you missed Santa. Not that there was much to miss. And the following weeks, too. I've been out for a month. And change. 
Yeah, you're damn lucky Dr. O'Neill was there when they fished you out of the water. It'll be a while before you're fully recovered, but better you get back on the horse than lie around here. Besides, we need the bed. They put what they could salvage of your gear in storage. Might want to pick that up first. And then Fei Lao wants to see you over in Ops. It's not over, you know. Not by a long shot. You'll have your hands full. Did you hear? That first wave agent over in the medical wing just woke up. Who? Look who's up and about. How are you feeling, Agent? A little sore. <laughs> yeah. Candle told me they plucked enough shrapnel out of you to fill a bucket. I'm Agent Fei Lao, Acting Division Commander in Midtown. What's the situation? Hmm. <sighs> Better than it was, but far from good. First wave agents like you are now a rare breed. Most are either MIA, KIA, or Rogue. Chief Meyer? KIA. Commander Chang? KIA. I was there. Damn. Not long after you were injured, many first wave agents were lost in the Dark Zone. HOTUS activated a second wave in early January. We've been fighting to regain control of Manhattan ever since. Our biggest headache was a PMC called the Last Man Battalion. Their leader, Charles Bliss, had a pretty messed up idea of what the future should look like. But we eliminated that threat. When the guards abandoned Rikers Island, the prisoners escaped. They were wreaking havoc on the city. When we took out their leader, Loray Barrett, they scattered. Not many of them are left in Midtown. The JTF is planning an assault on one of their last strongholds in Clinton. We also had the cleaners to contend with, and their boss, Joe Farrow, the one obsessed with cleaning the city of the virus. Happy to torch anything and anyone standing in their way. We dealt with them too, for the most part. And then, there's the asshole who caused all of this. The Variola Chimera, better known as the Green Poison Virus, was engineered and released by a deranged professor named Gordon Amherst. He had some sick notion about using natural selection to save humanity. His virus would weed out the weak. Amherst is no longer a threat. He was killed by his own creation. We recovered his research, and Dr. Candle says we're close to developing a vaccine. You said agents have gone rogue. You mean they betrayed us? It's not something we like to advertise. The Alpha among them is Aaron Keener. He's still at large. In summary, the situation isn't good, but it's not as bad as it was. There are bands of Rikers still around, but it's been a while since we saw any cleaners and whatever remains of the LMB. On a happier note, I'm sure you'll be glad to know that the civvies you got out of Chinatown are alive and well. They're building a settlement here. 
I'm sure they'd appreciate any assistance you can give them. You might even run into an old friend or two. Things are better, but the streets aren't exactly safe. Before you head out, make sure your kit is fully stocked. Good luck out there, Agent. Dr. Kendall said you might experience some lingering effects of the coma, but she expects you to heal quickly. That's good, because we need you. The city needs you. As for me, I'll be here, trying to keep this operation from running off the rails. If you need anything, you know where to find me. This is a public service announcement. Snow removal teams will be operating in areas near the base of operations starting next week. The most important thing is for people to avoid panic. Okay. 